All right. I would I would really be um remiss if I didn't make a comment uh regarding the situation. So let me um let me make a comment about it. Get it out the way. And um let y'all further know further know that we're going to be forced to love each other. We're going to be forced to um, protect each other to some degree. Otherwise, we're going to continue to keep getting this kind of treatment that we know that they're trying to break our backs with. Right? Okay. So with that being said, I want to kind of hold on a little bit because i got to let the two-minute mark pass. Um. But Dr. King said, injustice anywhere is injustice everywhere, basically. And whether you know what that boy did, whether you thought it was wrong, and you know it was wrong because I've said it, and we know it was wrong, what Jesse Smollett did, that's what I'm talking about. Now, but what's not funny is the fact that they would give that young man five months in the Cook County Jail. You have people who have raped people. White, of course. Or like the people who call the Karens, who call the police make false reports all the time. They don't even get prosecuted. Now, I'm not for one minute justifying what Juicy Smoothie did. Please don't misunderstand this. What I want you to understand is the fact I'm tired of the double standard. Ain't you? Black people, I'm talking to y'all specifically. Ain't y'all? You see, it's a listen. Either we gonna put up with this. Let, let me let me stop. We have to separate. We have to come out from under her. That's what I'm trying to say. By hell, high water, crook, nook. We gotta come from under her. She ain't never meant us no good. How we do it is how we do it. Listen to me good. How we do it is how we do it. Because to keep repeating and regret, listen, we fill the prisons up. They make money off of us. They, they create jobs off our misery, off our pain that they create and then tell you that they're going to come in and fix it for you. Come on. Now, I'm not condoning what Juicy Smoothie did one minute. But you mean to tell me you could have put him on a year probation? 18 months, two years probation? You wanted to put him in jail for five months and then admonish him by calling him all kinds of narcissistic? Yeah, maybe he is. But the whole goddamn country is narcissistic. So what are you saying? What are you saying, white man? You know, once you get, you know, I mean, it, it's, it's once you get uh, into your thick skull, how they really want to do us forever and ever and ever. Amen. <laughs> but you come to a point where it's like either fight, flight, or put up with it. I choose to fight. Okay? And the thing about it is, all this separate don't do nothing, but a fist ball can strike a mighty blow. And y'all act like Goliath can't be smacked. Y'all act like Goliath is all powerful. This, this, 
this prison industrial system complex that they didn't fill their jails up with our bodies? I seen Attica. But that should be the blueprint to, of, to, for something else. Everything has been laid out for us. The do's and the don'ts of survival. And if it's one thing we gonna do, we gonna survive. Oh, we may not, but we'll be here long after the white man is gone. We was here long before the white man got here, right? So come on. This right here, and it's somebody might say, wow, you taking that one to go off on? Yeah, because it's like y'all take every situation and try to exploit us. Every damn situation to make us the poster child for um uh 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 uh, uh, uh accountability. When when you don't take none, Donald Trump running a fucking muck. It, the politicians run a muck. They lie. They run. They gaslight. Nobody would dare think about uh, putting them, even putting them on probation. You won't even, you won't even indict this dude. And he's done all this stuff in America. But this actor got carried away with himself. Did something stupid, in my opinion, because I believe he did it. But then y'all want to give them jail time for five months? Who the fuck y'all think? When, who going to put y'all on trial? I charged the white man. What did Lewis X say? With being the biggest liar on earth. I, 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 I charged the white man with being the biggest deceiver on earth. I, I, I charged the white man with being the biggest murderer on earth. Now how much time you going to give the government of these United States? Got the nerve to throw out sentences like it's candy. Do our lives this way. I'm going to go now because I'm, I'm, I'm just disgusted at how we handle stuff. You know, it's a country. Then you, you, you look, you go over to Ukraine. And then I'm hearing they shipping people uh, other places. <laughs> Why they get the Ukrainians out? The son of man. If y'all don't know who y'all are by now, nobody got a place for us to lay our head. <laughs> but nine tenths of the world's population look like me. Talk about a mind screw. Boy, oh boy, I tell you. Anyways, I don't want to go too far off being for they flag my channel. Let me just say this. There's a scripture say that we must come from under her. From the great whore, the great, great big whore. And um, that's something we, 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 we got to stop being finessed by day system of doing things and until we can do that we'll never have an ounce of freedom ever with reparations without reparations don't even matter there need to be a new cleansing of the mind how can we even stand for them to sit up here and fill our bodies up in these prisons like this they just want to just keep throwing us in storage throw you in storage so they can keep a damn job off of us. They feeding off our misery like vampires. Like they need a host. They need a host. And the faster we see that, the more, the faster we go, and the harder we're going to reverse some of this self-hatred. I really do believe that. Maybe not in my lifetime, but I hopefully in my grandchildren's lifetime, if the media don't destroy us first, 
racism is definitely going to kill us. Double standard, bigotry, hatred is definitely going to destroy this planet. Because y'all ain't going to keep on feeding off us. I can tell you that. I'm speaking it into the universe. I'm speaking it into my generations. I'm the eve of the earth. I'm speaking it into the existence. Y'all ain't going to keep on doing us the way you're doing us. I mean that. So now I'm going to go. Because with that being said, if you like what you hear, like, subscribe, and share. And I'm going to see you in the next video.